Hi everyone, my name is Matt and you're watching the Syntax UK YouTube channel. Now with working from home becoming increasingly common globally, we've been looking at ways that you can improve your audio quality while working remotely, as well as ways that you can keep on collaborating from home. In one of our previous videos, we focused on the video apps Skype and Zoom. Now while these provide a really quick and easy way to collaborate online, their low quality, heavily compressed audio is not exactly ideal. So today I'm going to be talking about a really easy to use web-based app that will help improve your audio quality over the internet and that's called Source Connect Now. Now of course there are other options out there including Clean Feed Pro and Session Link Pro but overall we liked how easy to use Source Connect Now was as well as how it offers 256 kilobits per second in mono and 512 in stereo. I'm using a really simple but versatile setup for this tutorial consisting of the fabulous Loughton Audio LS208 front address microphone and an RME Babyface Pro audio interface. This is a compact setup that's perfect for podcasters looking for a high quality recording setup, as well as for producers that need equipment that's as powerful at home as it is in the studio. And by combining this professional level equipment with the power of Source Connect Now, I can get really impressive results over the internet. Source Connect Now allows you to invite up to nine other people into the chat and each person can even record their microphone to a WAV file making this a great way for podcasters to conduct interviews from home. Now we should mention that at the time of recording this video, the full version of Source Connect Now is completely free to use. However, their website says they will be moving to a subscription-based service towards the end of the year, which is something to be aware of. For now though, you can use the full version at no extra cost, and we found it to be a really reliable option for getting better audio quality when you're working remotely. What's more, you can easily combine it with a video app like Skype and Zoom so that you've got a video feed. All you need to do is remember that you need to mute the audio in Skype and Zoom so that it's not doubling up when you use Source Connect now. So let's take a quick look at how we set this up. In terms of total mix effects, the setup is exactly the same as in the other videos in our tutorial series. We'll make sure to route the microphone and software playback channel to our headphones so that we can hear it. And if we're using a smaller RME interface, you're good to go. If you're using an 802, UFX2 or UFX Plus, I suggest checking out video one in this series if you haven't already, as there's a couple of extra steps you'll need to make sure that you have your microphone routed correctly. Open the Source Connect Now webpage in Google Chrome and create an account for yourself so that you can host meetings. Once this is done, you just need to click Start Connection to get started. Here you can set your maximum number of guests as well as add the password required to join the meeting. Most importantly, you can adjust the quality of the audio you are sending at this point too. Now guest sign in is just as simple. Your guests type in your username, followed by a name for themselves and the password you set earlier. They can also adjust their audio quality at this point too. Once you're in a call, just double check your RME interface is selected as the input and output. And if it isn't, simply select it and refresh your settings. Source Connect Now also features a handy recorder which allows you to record your side of the conversation which you can then download at the end of the call. If you want to record the whole conversation like this, remember that each person will need to hit record for themselves on their own computer and send you the audio file afterwards. If you're planning to record in this way, it's probably safer to ask all of your chat members to record themselves in a DAW or using an app like QuickTime, as that way there won't be anything lost if anyone has connection problems during the call. Now those of you who are more familiar with RME interfaces will know that thanks to Total Mix FX, it's very easy to record the sound coming out Source Connect now into your DAW and this is something that we'll be looking at in our next video. If you have any other apps that you'd like to use, please do put them in the comment section below and we'll be sure to check them out. And as always, please do make sure that you like and subscribe to our channel so that you get to see all of our future content. Thanks very much guys, I'll see you again next time.